Richard Michael Patrick is an American musician, singer and songwriter. He is the frontman for the rock band Filter and a founding member of the supergroups Army of Anyone and the Damning Well, and has served as a touring guitarist for Nine Inch Nails. As a teenager, Patrick was the frontman for the act. He is the younger brother of actor Robert Patrick. After a chance meeting with Trent Reznor in a Cleveland music store, Patrick landed a gig as guitarist in Reznor's live incarnation of Nine Inch Nails from 1989 to 1993. His only recorded contribution can be heard at the end of Sanctified on Pretty Hate Machine. Patrick also appeared in the music videos for Down In It, Head Like a Hole, Wish, and one of the two promo videos for Gave. Up, which was filmed in the living room of the infamous house where Sharon Tate was murdered in 1969. As Reznor had leased the house and installed a recording studio in it. Patrick chose to leave the band during the recording of The Downward Spiral in 1993 following a comment from Reznor to get up off his ass and go write a record in response to Patrick asking for a bit of extra money. Before his departure from Nine Inch Nails, Patrick formed his own band, Filter, with Brian Lisegong, who left the band after the recording of the band's first album, 1995 Short Bus. Four years later, Richard Patrick released Filter's second album, Title of Record, with help from guitarist Gino Leonardo. Filter's third album, The Amalgamate, was released in 2002, with Patrick cancelling most of the supporting tour to check into rehab for alcoholism, a problem that had been plaguing him for years. An experience where he drank on an airplane inspired Filter's hit single Take a Picture. After a five-year hiatus, Filter released a fourth record on May 13, 2008, entitled Anthems for the Damned. Patrick did the vocals and the majority of the instrumentation on the album except for the drumming, which was done by Josh Fries. He also worked with Wes Borland and John Five on a few individual songs. For the first time in the band's history, the band released an album without a three to five year break in between, with their fifth record, The Trouble with Angels, which was released just over two years after Anthems on August 17, 2010. Patrick recorded the album with the Anthems for the Damn Touring Band, Micaiah Finio, Mitch Marlowe, and John Spiker, but recruited a new guitarist and bass player for touring in support of the album. Patrick returned to the studio in April 2012, to work with producer Bob Marlett and Kill Hannah guitarist, Johnny Radke, on his next Filter album, under the working title Gurney and the Burning Books. After Filter was signed to Wind Up Records in September 2012, Patrick released his sixth studio album The Sun Comes Out Tonight on June 4, 2013. In early 2015, Patrick reunited with Ben Grossa, Michael Blumpy Teller, Brian Virtue and former Filter guitarist Brian Lisagong to begin recording Filter's most recent album. After launching a pledge music campaign, Patrick and contributing artist Zomi Capilla, Chris Reeve and Ashley Zerigian released Filter's seventh studio album Crazy Eyes on April 8, 2016. In 2018, Patrick reunited with Brian Lisagong to record a follow-up to Short Bus entitled Rebus, and funded the project using Pledge Music. The project remains unreleased due to Pledge Music going bankrupt. Patrick and Lisa Gong decided to mount a title of record 20th anniversary tour in the fall of 2019, but the tour was cancelled due to scheduling conflicts with deadlines for film scores that Patrick was working on. In lieu of the Rebus release, Patrick instead plans to release a new Filter album with a different lineup of musicians entitled They Got Us Right Where They Want Us, at each other's throats. In the summer of 2020 the title of the album was changed to Murica. Patrick had a music video shoot for Army of Anyone in 2006 while writing songs for Filter's fourth album, Patrick called up the DeLeo brothers of Stone Temple Pilots to help him write a song. The result was a song called A Better Place. Due to the chemistry the trio had while writing the song, they decided to form a supergroup, which became Army of Anyone. On September 29, 2005, the formation of Army of Anyone was announced. Along with Dean and Robert DeLeo, future drummer for Korn, Ray Luzier, was also added to the lineup. Army of Anyone's self-titled debut album was released on November 14, 2006. The album's first single, Goodbye, peaked at number 3 on the U.S. Mainstream Rock Tracks chart. On May 26, 2007, Army of Anyone played their last concert to date in El Paso, Texas. The band has since been on hiatus. Patrick composed the score for Alexandros Avranis' 2016 film Dark Crimes, a crime thriller based on a 2008 David Grant article published in The New Yorker. In 2017, Richard and his brother Robert Patrick contributed to film score of Last Rampage. On August 25, 2008, Patrick wrote an editorial, talking about war, for the Huffington Post. He has since started writing a column, 
called Filtering the Truth, for Suicide Girls. His first post, about politics and religion, was posted on Election Day 2008. Patrick and his wife Tina have a daughter, born in 2008, and a son, born in 2009. Patrick graduated from Bay High School in Ohio in 1987. After years of alcohol and drug abuse issues, he has been sober since September 2002. Patrick's older brother is actor Robert Patrick. He is of Scotch-Irish and English ancestry. Thanks for watching.